In Barcelona today, elation. Separatists consider this the birth of their own independent state. It's a long time we are waiting for this moment. We deserve this. The historic independence vote came in the Catalan parliament. Opposition MPs would have none of it, some declaring their allegiance to Spain, then walking out. The nationalist majority still cast their ballots. Sí. 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 Most voted sí, yes to independence, declaring themselves free from Spanish rule and marking the occasion with Catalonia's own national anthem. Separatist leader Carles Puigdemont called on Catalans to maintain the peace, public spirit and dignity, as we've always done, he said. The police crackdown on the disputed independence referendum October 1st still fresh in the minds of many, enough for some to fear how Madrid will respond this time. It's not a question of will. At a certain point there will be an incident and then that could trigger a serious confrontation and nobody knows what can happen. So far, the government's answer has been peaceful but unprecedented. The Senate authorized Prime Minister Mariano Rajoy to impose direct rule, stripping Catalonia of its regional powers, a move never tested since Spain regained democracy. Tonight, the Prime Minister started wielding that new power. Les informo que hoy I have dissolved the Parliament of Catalonia and called elections in that region for December 21st, he announced. The Catalan president has been sacked, so too has the regional police chief. But in Barcelona, the party continues. A day of political fireworks is giving way to an uncertain future. Thomas Dagg, CBC News, London.